Hello everyone, this is Mr. SpinQ. Today, I want to share how quantum computers can determine if an ATM needs to be removed. ATMs were once called the most useful invention in banking. With their convenience and time-saving features, they were highly favored by banks. However, with the rise of mobile payments, more people have become accustomed to completing transactions online, reducing the need for cash and the usage rate of ATMs. Meanwhile, the cost of maintaining ATMs remains high. Under operational pressure, many commercial banks have decided to remove ATMs. For commercial banks, the challenge in managing ATMs lies in their wide distribution, large number, and complex environments, and customer bases in different areas, deciding to remove ATMs quite challenging. Traditional methods to solve these issues often involve classical computers, using either manual or machine learning to build intelligent models. However, these methods have significant drawbacks, the complexity of the model algorithms results in slow and time-consuming computations, and the accuracy of the model evaluations is not high. In order to solve the problem of optimizing the layout of ATM machines, Longying Jida, a wholly owned technology company of Huaxia Bank, has cooperated with SpinQ, and the two companies have carried out the empirical analysis of quantum neural network on the nuclear magnetic quantum computer independently researched and developed by SpinQ. A quantum neural network is a parameterized quantum circuit that can be used to run quantum variational algorithms as well as to handle the same target problem as a classical neural network. The collaboration consisted of four main stages. One. Data collection, the partners selected 2,243 ATMs as data samples, spanning two years of data across 31 provinces, municipalities, and autonomous regions in China. The ATMs included cash dispensers, deposit withdrawal integrated machines, and recycling machines. 2. Model construction, by selecting feature parameters and using statistical methods to process the data, they derived four feature parameters, number of malfunctions, cash replenishment time, off-counter rate trend, and average daily busy time. The output labels were defined as remove and do not remove. 3. Data transformation. They used quantum variational embedding to encode the data into quantum format. Four. Running the quantum neural network model, the constructed quantum neural network model was run on the quantum computer to obtain experimental results. In terms of the final result, the quantum neural network is utilized to make a judgment on whether a commercial bank ATM machine is called or not, with an accuracy rate of 75%. Compared with the classical algorithm, the quantum neural network model not only improves in accuracy, but also operates faster. It is worth mentioning that quantum computing can realize to find the optimal solution for a TM placement in the absence of sample parameters, which is more accurate than classical computers. Since the application of the project results in Huaxia Bank, it has been applied and promoted in the operation and management lines of all branches with remarkable results. The results of the project also won the first prize of the 2020 PBOC Financial Technology Development Award, which is the first time in the history of the award in the field of quantum computing.